There are also ongoing conversations about maybe we should begin to explore the use of you know, indigenous knowledge. So for instance, should we begin to take a look at maybe herbs uh, you know, as Africans and as Nigerians while we wait for this vaccine that is being tried out? What's your thought on that? Yeah, you know, the truth is Nigeria has been making some big progress in terms of herbal medicine. Uh, we have a phytomedicine uh, uh, department in the University of Jos, and when this, um, when this coronavirus thing came out, they actually did some preliminary uh, testing, and they found some of our ingredients that are active against the virus. So they are in the process of collaboration and, you know, trying to submit that also to um, the agencies responsible. So, yes, definitely Nigeria must begin to develop um, her own way out, including herbal medicine. The only problem I've had with people who claim to have um, these cures is not submitting them to appropriate testing protocols okay and so one of the, the truth is that we we have a lot of things hidden here but the problem with our people is that we are not ready to follow lay down guidelines and rules you know people just wake up and go on youtube go on television to say i have cure for hiv i have cure for coronavirus it doesn't work that way okay look at what we are talking about at, at this vaccine testing People are, they are trying to reduce it from, you know, less than 18, uh, 18 months. And they are engaging countries are, around the world, scientists, re, uh, researchers, developers, manufacturers, and even funders are all engaged, you know, in an attempt to make sure that this thing is standard, the best feasible thing is done, it is safe and it is effective. That's what any drug protocol should go through. So whether it is herbal medicine or it's orthodox, whatever you have, bring it to the table. The Federal Ministry has suffered some years now, created a department in Federal Ministry of Health for herbal medicine and traditional medicine so that they can try bring these things to the, to the mainstream and be able to pass them through regular processes. Because if you bring a herb and say it kills this, how do we know that that thing that is killing that virus will not also kill a human being? It needs to be tested. It needs to be fine-tuned. It needs to be refined. That's the processes that our people are missing. I'm sure by now we should be in a position to have come up with something very reasonable. Mm -hmm. But because people are hoarding, you know, people want to keep things to themselves and, and take the whole advantage of it. That's why we are not moving. But if they will bring it out, whatever herbal medicine they have, if they will bring it out to NAFTA and let them put it through regulation and proper testing, I'm sure we'll be able to get something.